a permutation combination practice question. This question deals with the concept of circular permutation with a constraint thrown in to make it a little spicier. Eight directors, the vice chairman and the chairman are to be seated around a circular table. If the chairman sits between a director and the vice chairman, in how many ways can they be seated? The clear constraint given to us is that the chairman should be flanked by a director and a vice chairman. So the chairman is here, he needs to have a vice chairman on one side and a director, not a specific director, some director on the other side. Let's look at it. What does a team comprise? The team comprises eight directors, one chairman and one vice chairman. Now, even though this looks like the constraint, the constraint actually boils down to just seating the chairman and the vice chairman next to each other. Because if you have the chairman here and the vice chairman, on the other side of the chairman, you can only have a director. There is no one else in the team. The team comprises directors, chairman, vice chairman. One side vice chairman, the other side has to be someone and that someone is going to be a director. So you don't need to bother about thinking of keeping a director on one side. The director will definitely, there is going to be a director on one side. So only thing that we need to bother about is placing the chairman and vice chairman next to each other. If you have to ensure that this happens, then all that we are going to do is to keep a chairman and vice chairman as a single unit. We are not going to be dividing them into two individuals. We are going to be looking at them as one single unit. Now let's see, can this unit have variant ways of being made? In the sense, can we make the unit as chairman, vice chairman, chairman to the left, vice chairman to the right, and vice chairman to the left and chairman to the right. There are two ways in which we can seat the chairman and vice chairman, even though they are seated next to each other. So the reordering of the chairman and vice chairman can happen in two ways or two factorial ways. Now what are we left with? If you made them as one unit, we'll call it as VC or CV as one unit. I'm just going to number, this is director 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and this one unit of the vice chairman and chairman together. So how many units do we have? Eight directors and one unit of vice chairman and chairman. So we're going to be reordering nine units around a circular table. So essentially, this is a circular permutation of nine objects. How many ways can n objects be permuted around a table or around a circle? They can be permuted around a circle in n minus one factorial ways. We have nine objects to be reordered around a circular table. In how many ways can we do it? We can do it in nine minus one factorial or this is equal to eight factorial. So we could reorder these nine units around a circular table in eight factorial ways. And we also reordered the chairman and vice chairman between themselves in two factorial ways. So total number of reorderings available is a product of these two. Number of ways of reordering chairman and vice chairman which is equal to two factorial. Number of ways of permitting the entire group of nine around a circle, which is eight factorial ways. So two factorial into eight factorial is the required answer. Quickly summarize this last bit in a printed form. The eight, nine objects around a circle can be reordered in factorial eight ways. Final answer is the product of these two things. Number of ways of reordering chairman and vice chairman into the total number of circular permutations available. Two factorial into eight factorial or eight factorial into two is the answer. Choice D is the correct answer. Is the quant section of the GRE examination Sign up for the most comprehensive and affordable online quant course for the GRE at online.vizaco.com. I'll repair it. It's online.vizaco.com. Two, check out the related videos and remember to subscribe to this channel.